Hola, señores y señoritas y señoras. ¿Dónde está el baño? Yeah, that's that's right. That's uh, I can speak Spanglish, 100%. I don't actually. I think I said that all right. I'm not exactly sure. I know the whole "dónde está el baño" is correct because that is one of the phrases when I was actually taking the two years of Spanish. Um, that I took in high school, um, that's pretty much what I got out of it, is donde esta el baño, because you never know when in a Spanish-speaking place of when you need to uh, go to the go to the bathroom, or figure out where the bathroom's at. Anyway, hello everyone, and um, welcome to episode 36 of The Road to Glory. Today's episode is chock full of some more gameplay just like it has been the past I don't know how many episodes I mean just because I well it was at this point it was at this point you knew um no but it was after this around it was before this that I was actually able to get out from being unassigned with all of the Mario Getzas that I had just stocked up don't exactly know if I am going to do the whole unassigned thing again. I don't really have much as far as coins go. If I get lucky with... Man, what a poor pass, man. I just suck at this game sometimes. Um, <laughs> but I'm not exactly sure how many coins I will have. I can whip out my little calculator here on my cellular phone um right now i'm sitting at about 40k and you'll see that at the end of the video because i did have to purchase a couple of players for the bundesliga guaranteed team of the season pack because i didn't want to put uh the team of the season moments and Fati in there i didn't want to put him in there if i would have put him in there it would have been essentially free Pretty much, yeah. But at that point, I would have been putting in, you know, a 90 rated, a 91 rated, and an 89 rated into an 86 rated squad, and that just doesn't seem like a very good idea. So, sitting at about 40k, we're going to be getting 45k because, remember, because, did get gold too, because I'm like a pro at this game, even though I'm not, even though I suck, plus 45k. And plus, more than likely 58k. So that's about 143k. You add in there, maybe, ooh, maybe, no. So we'll just gonna, we're just gonna take 143k. All right. And if I purchase them early tomorrow morning, after I get my Fut Champs and my Rivals rewards done, then, then I would be able to purchase the. Syria players, which again, I just assume Syria is coming up next. And what a goal there. Onana just didn't, he just didn't even move because he just knew it was going in. He just knew, he just knew Royce was a beast and just, you know, put it in. Um, but if, if the players are about 1500 coins, which they are about right now, that's about 95 players. And if they go up to the 2200 mark, more than likely, or 2100 even. So we'll just say 2100. Uh, take off 95%. That is 183k, which is a profit of 40k. That would mean that I would have to sit on a sign for. Yeah, I'd have to sit on a sign for majority of Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then half of Monday. That's like four. That's a total of like four days. For 40k profit, that is just not worth it in my books. The only way that I would go unassigned again is if I had like a million coins or if I knew for a fact they were going to go up to 2,500, um, is that they were going to go up to 2,500 coins just guaranteed. But I know for a fact that they will not, especially the Syria, because the amount of people who have interest in Syria is just not nearly as much 
as places as ones like the Premier League or with Ligue 1. Uh, just given the fact of, and then also given the fact of what's happened with the Bundesliga rares, they haven't flown up in price like previous previous ones. Um, big first off, like big big thank you to this guy. Um, completely forgot to message him, and um, yeah, completely forgot to message the guy. Um saying thank you for helping me win the do not yeah giving me the win and letting me do objectives and stuff like that so big big thank you to that man's right there or ladies or whatever you know whatever um what was i saying oh yeah i'm just i just don't feel like heavily investing in rares is going to be a really isn't going to be a really big great idea for me because I like to open bronze packs and ever since coming out from un unassigned I went from like I want to say like 13 1400 players 1500 players probably all the way up to just north of 2200 players already so I kind of like to open bronze packs and I've already got two Paderborn players, I've got multiple Brescia players, I've got multiple squad fitness cards, what else, there was some other player that was, oh yeah, the one Belgian left back from Norwich, I've gotten him like three or four times, so like, I've already gained, like that 40k that I would get if I sat on a sign for however many days, five, five days, four days, I've already made that back in what you, what you call it bronze packs so you know it's kind of like it's to me it's just kind of stupid because then i still i can't open any any packs whatsoever i can just play the game and i don't want to do that personally i i really just don't the other major point thing that i need to talk about for today is i am going to be away for like four days four days total so what i'm thinking about doing is since i'm not going to do i made the decision i'm not going to be playing fut champs this weekend i want a weekend off where i don't have to worry about playing competitive fifa on that level i just don't want to do it especially for cards that i don't really care about because going forward it's just going to be a Bundesliga team for the rest of the season. Um, I might not even play next weekend either. Might take a week off then too, and or maybe just next weekend go to Silver One um, and be done and be done there. Silver One or Gold Three next weekend, probably Silver One, so I can at least get one red player. And then the ultimate team of the season should be after that. That is going to be one that I will play my butt off to try and get the best red player picks that I could possibly get. Um, obviously trying to push for gold one. Probably will end up settling for gold three or gold two. Um, but, oh well. But yeah, I am going to be away. And there's the 94th minute actually. I got the got a finesse goal there with Griezmann. I felt really good about myself. Um, but yeah, I am going to be away for a few days. What I'm thinking about doing is obviously tomorrow's video is going to be rewards, um, rewards, and probably some more gameplay of me. I guess just playing the game, trying to well. No, yeah, yeah, it'll be more, it'll be more gameplay pushing up to the 28 or 29,000 points that I need for rank one in Div 5 because I'm sitting at like 22 or 23k right now, so I'll still have to play some games. I'll just show the wins because I don't like showing losses, it's that's just whatever. Um, so it'll be some gameplay, and then at the back end of it will be the rewards as you see me claiming 
that team of the season so far, Sabitzer, who is, by the way, a fantastic card. I have very thoroughly enjoyed him in my team. He is a very good card. If you have not gotten him, I highly recommend getting him. Even if he's just a super sub, just go and get him. He's free. It takes, like, a, it takes a few hours. You know, just do it. Um, same thing with Matthew. It takes a few hours. Just go do it. You know, it ain't bad. Um, but what was I saying? I swear to everything, this happens every single video. Like, it, my little my little a bit of amount of ADD that I actually have just kicks in, and it's like, ooh, squirrel, ooh, shiny. Just, oh, goodness sakes. Uh, I get so distracted so easily sometimes. What, what, I gotta think really hard. I gotta put my thinking cap on. Uh, oh, yeah. I was talking about what tomorrow's video is going to be. But the back end of it is going to be rewards. So that'll be for tomorrow's video, so Thursday's video. The other thing is what I think is cool is EA are trying to push more people. They're actively trying to push more people into draft. Like, that is very much so a, a fact at this point because they gave away or they are giving away two free foot draft tokens from the season objectives one's for offline draft one is for online draft and then well no they're both draft tokens so it should just be two two free draft tokens that you get i, I don't know i've gotten one of them done i got the online draft one done not the not the offline one done the other one that they're giving away is in one of the bundesliga challenges where the cost of the sbc is more than the cost of a draft entry so i'm not doing that because that is dumb that is just dumb so what i think for friday is friday and saturday actually i think are going to be two drafts um, if both of them, yeah, they both should be dra just regular draft tokens. So I can do two online drafts, even though I don't necessarily like the draft, it will give me the ability to try and purchase more, um, mo not purchase, but it'll give me the opportunity to pack more players to put into the club. And there you saw me get rid of that Gerard Moreno for Luis Diaz. In my opinion, that was a very good trade-off. Um, even I just think Luis Diaz is just a way better player than Gerard Moreno. Has better, you know, four-star, four-star. Um, I think just has better card stats all around. Uh, also had to get rid of a. 83 Kramerich didn't really want to discard him. Plus, I needed a Liga Nos player to get assists with so I could do Jeremy, so I could finish up Jeremy Matthew. Um, didn't really want to go purchase one, so I just went and did Diaz. Plus, I turned Gerard Moreno from one team of the season into two team of the seasons, technically, so I, I just felt like it was a good trade off. And now I am completing the marquee matchups, the flashback marquee matchups. I'm not going to do the any of like the Bundesliga challenges or anything like that right now, especially that draft token one. Today they released one that it was a guaranteed 83 plus player, and I understand that if I did it, I have a chance of packing a team of the season, or I have a chance of packing something good. But if you go look at the price of it, it's just actually i don't i don't know what the price of it is um wow 44k for the league and awesome one <laughs> um yeah that's 20k the bundesliga challenge is 20k that is absurd the one to get the 83 plus um player pack that is absolutely absurd and then the draft token pack one is 19k so i'm just and then the one where you get 283 plus players is 32k so that's a little bit better but still not no so i'm not doing any of the any of the 
challenges. They are just not worth it in any way, shape, or form. I recommend that you don't do them either, but whatever, it's your club. You do what you want. I'm not going to... Um, I won't scold you. I promise. I'm not. I'm not. Ups, I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed, as the typical parent would say. Um, but here, just opening up the marquee matchups packs. Didn't really actually have to spend a whole heck of a lot of money on them to finish it, uh, and just you know, fills the club up with more, with even more players to do future SBCs with. Um, oh yeah, that's right. I will also have to do the advanced league SBCs. Those are going to be very, 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 very important for the club for me to get those done because they all have really good packs. Man, I have a lot to do in just a short amount of time. Like I have like a day to do all of this. Uh, I don't wanna, but whatever, um, yeah, that is going to be the plan, um, I guess, long and short of it, the plan is going to be tomorrow is mainly going to be rewards day with some gameplay, Friday is definitely going to be a draft, I will just go through the draft, um, live, uh, build it live, it'll be the first one I've actually done in a quite some time. I just don't I just don't like draft personally um, unless it's free then I'll go do it but if it's I, I just don't like paying 15k for it um, even though it is pretty much like with my with my skill level I should at least be able to win the first one or two games so I should be able to make some sort of profit my goodness I have the hiccups excuse me it seems like I always have the hiccups all the time Maybe it's because I breathe too much. Maybe I should just stop breathing. Is that is that a good idea? Or maybe I should take some water. Here, I'll, I'll take a drink of water. Oh. Oh, yeah. That tastes good. My, my, my mouth was parched. It was parched. Uh, we did go ahead and play, I think, three games. Yeah, three games to get to finish up Jeremy Mathieu. Um, they weren't terribly exciting i won all three of them um and then got over a thousand foot champs qualification points again and got all the way up to 1250 point skill rating points which means that i am now in division four and the little the, the meme for that the simpsons character ralphie where he's like sitting in the bus and he's like he laughs and he's like haha i'm in danger that's me right now. That's the way that I feel when I'm in Division 4. How am I in Division 4? I don't know. I don't understand. But I am. So whatever. And there you go. There is the foot draft token. At least the online section one of it. So we'll go ahead and get the offline one done as well. So I can get the second pack. The second free draft token. Maybe we'll just do that one for... Um, for later on at some point but since again since i will be gone um i won't be able to record anything i won't claim anything big um i guess i, I won't really claim anything from objective wise i'll probably just start working towards the milestone players um essentially especially the bundesliga one i'll just start working towards that Maybe I'll build, I'll build out a front three or front four with, um, with, you know, I don't know what I think I've done five out of 18 teams or six out of 18 teams, whichever teams I haven't done, I'll just go and purchase a couple players from it and just work towards getting the, getting the Bundesliga milestone player completed. Get that ver I think it's very straight, very straight. I think. Um, he's Belgian, so I don't know, do you, like, pronounce that, like, in a French kind of accent? Because Belgian people, they speak French, don't they? Yeah. Yeah, they speak French. Don't they? Or am I just high thinking about that? I'm fairly certain they speak French. What language do Belgians speak? Uh, Dutch, French, and German. 
that's actually not not <laughs> terribly um terribly what is it what's the word what is the word surprising considering it's surrounded by french france the netherlands and germany so yeah they speak french in there is it so is it very straight i don't know i can't print i can't even speak french hola is that french i know that's spanish i'm an idiot <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> that wasn't even a joke i'm not kidding you that is not even a joke but here we go here is the bundesliga team of the season pack um there you go i did purchase matt tummels for 31 and k because i didn't want to get rid of ansu fati because i have too much of a connection to him the other two players falcao and matthew they can they can leave i don't really give a darn about either one of them honestly not a fan of either player and going into this pack all i wanted just just like anything that i could just put into my team i didn't even care if i got hinteregger or ginter just not one of the goalkeepers so i'm 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 nervous at this point and there's the blue flares and then there's the finland flag and i wanted to throw my controller out of the window and obviously i just uh wasn't wasn't very happy i was not happy at this point i'm i'm just thinking like like genuinely the one player i didn't want or one of the one players i just didn't want and that's what you give me and here we go. We're doing the Liga Nos guaranteed pack. The only player I had to purchase was that Wesley. I'm throwing Hradecki in there because screw him and screw EA. Um, <laughs> I didn't really care uh, to to even keep him. He's just he's like 30k uh, genuinely. So I, I'm not upset in any way. Um, but go to open it, and I'm thinking, maybe I'll get lucky. Maybe I'll get a Brazilian flag. Maybe I'll get a Brazilian left back in Tellez. Yeah, um, uh, that didn't happen. Portuguese. I was like, oh, okay, Rafa or whatever, PZ? No, striker. And then you get this guy. The person that, exa this, is, this is the guy exactly why I think Syria is coming, because he's going to be a Cristiano Ronaldo troll. Oh, well, whatever. Um, that is going to be the end of today's video. Here's the squad that I kind of want, but might not get. Whatever, I don't know. I want I want to purchase that Tiago, but I probably won't be able to. But that is the end of today. I will see all of you in tomorrow's episode. Bye. -bye.